Native plants are natural plants. Natural plants are electrical. Why? The base of natural plants, the very foundation, is what the Chinese call the CHO arrangement. Carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. So in life, to life expression, for life to express itself or to exist, there has to be what? Carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. The Chinese call it the Cho. I agree. It is the structure that would allow a substance to readily assimilate biologically without carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. That substance is non electrical, it is non organic. So as we travel, journey of healing, we want, we want to ask one question that hasn't been asked in my lifetime that I know about and probably it has been asked. And I am totally unaware of it. It doesn't mean that it wasn't asked. Why do we get sick? Sense. 
why are we shaking? And where is the violation? Look carefully about the way the African live in the jungles. Look at the way the anchor live in the desert of Africa. Look at the way the Maya live in Central America. And then we go to the Tortes and the Olmec in Mexico. Then we go to the Cheyenne and the Sioux. Those American Indians. Carefully, we're going to begin with that. The African, the anchor from South America, the Maya Central America, the Tartics and the Ornic from Mexico, and the American brothers and sisters, natives. You know what we are called by certain, on certain levels of understanding? We are called the organic family. The organic family all families are organic, not so. What do you mean by that? You see, the organic family is exactly what we say it is. Organic. No waste. We do not produce waste. Everything about us is recyclable. And this is why we didn't have any toilets. Oh God, what is this? This man is showing me something that I have never before. We didn't have any toilets. Sit down. We didn't have any toilets. We didn't need that. Remember, what we ate was products that are considered native. No starch, no uric acid, no blood. No blood, no starch. Uric acid, blood. Carbonic acid, starch. You see, when we ate, we ate electric food. That's all we had in our environment. The organic family only had electric food as part of the diet. So they eat very little and infrequent. It was necessary to eat three times a day. The plate full of tanya, dashing, cassava, and blood. Not to mention the rice. with the 
family. So I was compelled to direct my thought patterns, my vision towards the continent. I am an African. And what does that mean? It means that when creation designed the African, there was a food that was designed for that African. And if you believe that this is an untrue, well then, let us take the diet of the African and give it to the man that lives in the ice. The Inuit. No. He was designed to eat whale and fish. We were designed to eat something green. with our genetical predisposition. So now we come to why we are sick. The African had a food, the Eskimo had a food, the Inca had a food that you do not find in Africa. You know what is in Africa you find in Peru. But what he needed was in Peru. And what I needed was in Africa. If I ever make the mistake and select a component or a thought from another gene predisposition or another geography, I'm only saying, hey fellas, I am blind. I, I need to go to Kathmandu. I need to go to Nepal. I need to go to India. I am 
Johnny. But I come down here with my suit, my tie, and my cup of coffee. Not to mention my watch and my Mercedes. But one day, very soon, the doctors would say, Hey man, you got something on you, in you, about you. And what is that dog is cancer. Cancer? Well, my ancestors didn't have cancer. It was unknown. Why do I have cancer? Well, the virus. And what do you have? Oh, uh, the other one has AIDS. Uh, that's the virus. The other one? Herpes, that's the virus. Everything happened to be a virus, a germ, or a bacteria. How do we know that? We don't know that. Among all the writers in the black community, in the diaspora, none of them paid attention to what we should have been paying attention to. Our health. Our health. That would privilege me. We help me to love you and each other and myself first. That was omitted. We know all about the religious people. We know all about the cross of Jesus. We know all about that. But when we go home to eat, we eat something that was definitely offended our biological and cellular structure. Why is that? Where did that message come from? That we were supposed to eat starch and blood of the diet. When these things offend the black man's biology. So, today, we are carving out a little path into the past and what we found that yes, we are a member of the organic family and that we didn't have any ways to rid ourselves from. But once in a while in New York, in LA, and anywhere you go, you see these trucks that written on them, it says waste management. How do you manage waste? I don't know. It's waste. Why even manage it? Why produce it? This is the reason why we are sick.